Listening forty four. Listen and read. As good as new. We all want to help the planet, but we want to look good too. Now you can buy lots of great clothes and accessories, and protect the environment at the same time. Would you like some new shoes? They're colourful, fashionable, and guess what? They used to be car tyres. It's easy for scientists to recycle car tyres and use the rubber to make new things. Do you like this fun bag? It's bright and trendy, but can you guess what people made it with? Have a look. This bag used to be old juice cartons. This colourful T-shirt used to be plastic bottles. It takes five large plastic bottles to make one large T-shirt. You can buy baseball caps that used to be plastic bottles too. Guess what? These beautiful bracelets used to be old newspapers, comics, and bus tickets. Next time you are out shopping, see how many recycled items you can find. Or why not try making something new from your old rubbish? You can make greetings cards from old paper, magazines, or paper bags. You can make book covers from old carrier bags, posters, maps, or even clothes. You can save wrapping paper, gift boxes, and ribbons, and use them again. We want to hear about your ideas too, so we're having a competition. What can you make with your rubbish? Send us an email with a photo. We'll send a cool, as good as new T-shirt to the ten readers with the best ideas, and we'll print your photos in our next magazine. Listening forty-five. Listen. What did the children make? We read about a fun recycling competition in our favourite magazine, and we decided to enter. We thought about it for a few days, and then we had a great idea. We had some old jeans, so we decided to use them to make pencil cases. We cut pieces from the jeans. We used the pieces of jeans to make the pencil cases, and then we decorated them with special pens. We made two pencil cases. One of the pencil cases had my name on. And the other pencil case had my name on. Yes. Then we sent the pencil cases to the magazine. We waited for a week, and then we got a letter from the magazine. They loved our idea, and they sent us two as good as new T-shirts. We were very happy. The next week, there was a photo of our pencil cases in the magazine. Then all our friends wanted pencil cases with their names on. We made lots of pencil cases, and we sold them at school. We gave the money to charity. It was great.